I am Amit Lunkar, and today we discuss about the synthesis of methyl benzoate from benzoic acid. So, aim of this today's practical is to synthesize methyl benzoate from benzoic acid. With it involves basic principle as methyl benzoate is formed by the condensation of methanol and benzoic acid in presence of strong acid. Here is the reaction. The benzoic acid, when it reacts with methanol in presence of concentrated sulfuric acid, it forms a methyl benzoate and loss of one water molecule. Now, next one is the reaction mechanism involved in this synthesis. In this synthesis. So, the first step is protonation of benzoic acid forms a resonance stabilized cation. So, here is the reaction in which the benzoic acid gets protonated in presence of acid and it forms a resonance stabilized cation. Here is the cation means the carbon which are having a positive charge. Then next stage, next step is the methanol adds to this carbocation. As this carbon which are having positive charge to this the methanol in which oxygen, which is a having electron rich one. So it gets attracts toward this and it forms a intermediate or this addition product. And there is a further loss of proton and loss of water molecule to give a methyl benzoate. So this is the reaction mechanism which involved in synthesis of methyl benzoate. In next is the procedure. In RBF, place a mixture of benzoic acid, methanol and concentrated H2SO4. Then attach a reflux condenser and boil the mixture gently for four hours. After the four hours, distill off excess of methanol and then cool it and transfer the mixture to separating funnel. Add 10 to 15 ml of water to it and shake it with 5 ml of carbon tetrachloride. Upon standing, the heavy solution of methyl benzoate in carbon tetrachloride separate sharply at the bottom, bottom of separating funnel. Run off the lower layer carefully and reject the upper aqueous layer. Then shake the carbon tetrachloride layer with strong solution of sodium bicarbonate so as to remove unreacted benzoic acid. Wash once with water and dry by pouring into a small dry conical flask containing 5 gram of magnesium sulfate so as to remove the water molecule and shake it and keep for half an hour and filter it, weigh it and take physical constant. Here, the methyl benzoate which we obtain in a liquid form. Stage is calculation part, calculation of theoretical yield. For that, you have to calculate the molecular weight by considering the molecular formula of benzoic acid which is a starting reagent and the methyl benzoate which is a product. So here is the molecular formula of these two with molecular weight. Then you have to calculate the theoretical yield means 122 gram of benzoic acid gives 136 gram of methyl benzoate. So 3 gram of benzoic acid gives how much of methyl benzoate. So here we have taken 3 gram of benzoic acid. So just make a cross multiplication and you will get the value which is nothing but the theoretical yield. Now next one is the calculation of percent practical yield. Suppose you will get the 2.11 gram of methyl benzoate. You have to take the methyl benzoate which is in a liquid form in a 
suitable container and weigh it so this is comes in gram then you have to calculate the theoretical yield which is 3.34 gram then calculate the percent practical yield by using the formula practical yield divided by theoretical yield into 100 just put up the value and you will get the percent practical yield here is 63.17 gram 0.17 percent next one is the result draw the structure with molecular formula molecular weight theoretical yield practical yield percent practical yield physical constant that is boiling point which is 196 degree centigrade and uses it is used in perfumes also used as pesticide and also having a bacteriostatic action so here we finish the synthesis of methyl benzoate hope all of you getting thank you and happy learning